the numbers are pretty crystal clear. We are not seeing a recovery, even if you looked at government projects, uh, the delays that you're Pleasure. seeing. Pleasure. Uh, and this is, this is government data, this is government published data. If you look at pub, uh, top line growth of private sector capital goods companies, that's not showing any sign of confidence as well. What is the sense you're getting, Shubda? Are, you, are we in for a prolonged period of a fixed capital formation or capital investment spending slowdown? I would think so, Harsha, because the worry is uh, mounting quite clearly. Uh, you know, the last five quarters average on capital formation stands at an abysmally low at 1.3. Quite clearly a reflection of what's happening on the ground in terms of uh, picking up investment. Uh, of course, there, there was one factor which was global weak demand conditions which did not suddenly allow the domestic capacities to continue to expand. But more importantly, the domestic demand had remained fairly strong. So in that light, uh, the domestic investment demand also should have been to some extent kept pace. I think critical to all this is uh, our, uh, you know, perhaps uh, not uh, well-conceived strategy on resources Harsha. I think India can ill afford uh, a lack of uh, thinking or thought through strategy as far as resources is concerned. A large part of the problems today emanate from, if you will, you know, look at the mining data, it is at a 10 to 15 year low. You look at the core sector data, it's multi-year low. Manufacturing as a result has been a 15 year low. I mean, what does this all tell? That there is not just, the, in addition to the rising costs, earlier was the raw material cost, the input cost going up, uh, or the interest costs in the recent times, but more importantly, the policy paralysis, so to speak, has had a serious damage on the investment sentiment. I think we seriously need a center state greater coordination on policy. Second, the way Cabinet Committee on Investments is, is been formulated at the center, why not look at similar kind of arrangement at the state level? We need to look at stalled projects. Yes, there have been announcements in terms of addressing the bottlenecks concerning those projects, be it on land acquisition or environment clearances and so on. But on the ground, we do not yet see a significant amount of coordination. No doubt, over the last couple of months, government has been putting out the progress made sure. on, on various fronts, uh, you know, in terms of uh, de-bottlenecking the investments. Sure. But I'm afraid that we have seen so many quarters of slowdown. I think we need to step up on the accelerator as far as addressing these concerns are concerned. <laughs>